TechCrunch Disrupt here with Air Wonder. And who yes. are you? Uh, my name is Ella, I'm founder of Air Wonder. So it says here travel more, pay less. Yes. Uh, flight combination engine. So yes. you combine different companies or what do you do? We combine flights. So Let me show work? you how it works. So you hook up to the to the full database, what's it called, the one that Google bought? Is that the one that has all the flights and uh, prices? IETA and Matrix. <laughs> well, we have our own partnerships, so... To get the database on every yeah, airline? Yeah, and we have our own database, too. So, where would you like to go? Uh, I'd like to go to uh, Seychelles. Seychelles. That's a nice place. Well, uh, there's a Y, uh, y, y here. here. Y. write it, actually. S-E-Y. Ah, uh, okay. This one, top one there. Top one. Oh, yeah. all right. Got it. <laughs> Uh, any particular day? I want to go tonight or tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. All right, that's going to be expensive, but okay. let's do it. So, uh, this is kind of our uh, biggest uh, uh, biggest point um, between London and Seychelles. Nice, so you can go through Paris, it's cheaper? Exactly. Really? It shows you the price difference. So, what's the price? The estimated price. So, it's 632 from London? And it would be cheaper if you go through Paris? Exactly, yeah. So how so do that, I get to Paris? Uh, Is that included in this price? Yes. So now uh, you go, you can decide on the number of days ah, you, you can you get a stopover that. somewhere. You get a stopover, that's exactly what it is. Those are the list of the places you can stop on the way. You can decide on the number of days, there's no limit to the number of days. You can stay, for example, six days somewhere. Also, like, uh, those predictions are unique for every flight. So it changes, depends on your origin, destination, and the number of days. This is what, the number of days you want to spend there? You want to spend in stopover. Ah, on the stopover, In one of yes. those cities. So, right. What yeah, if you, you go down to one? What happens? Uh, if you go down to one... And the prices adu uh, update automatically? You can still, yeah, they update still automatically. I guess for, for this, there's no update. There's the same price. Depends. So what happens in Paris? What yeah. is the exact uh, combination that you need to do? So uh, now Air Wonder combines the flights for you. It looks for two one-way flights and a multi-city flight. And whatever will be cheapest is going to be displayed as your top result. And that's exactly what I needed to do last time. I had to go, and it was uh -huh. cheaper to go through. A, like I had to go in another another country. Yeah. But you do it automatically. We do it automatically. That's exactly what we did because we were going through that pain ourselves, and combining flights manually just is so time consuming that we automated the process. So you can go Vuling and Turkish Airlines. Uh, Turkish Airlines is the cheapest right now for yeah. some reason because so they have issues. Select. Oh, select, yeah. But no, uh, you went back. <laughs> uh, I went back. I want to try something else. Okay. Uh, let's sure. try. What uh, do you try? Maybe you want to check anywhere and see what other available. You can do anywhere. You can do anywhere, and that's going to show you the cheapest uh, places going from London. So let's see what it will, what we'll have. But from twenty one dollars, you can go to Italy. Yes. But it's not return, is it? Uh, no, it's just, this is just one way. <laughs> oh, one way. That would be a little bit crazy. Uh, yeah, and you can go to France, all, all those are places you can go from uh, UK and the prices. And you can go round trip? Yes, you can go round trip, but those are the predictions only for one way. Ah, okay. You, we you, just launched, so we don't have the predictions for round trips yet. So you just um, launched? We launched yesterday, we were part of the uh, startup battlefield. Here Did, in, are in you Tegra. qualified for winning the whole uh, thing? No, we didn't make it to the finals. Why? <laughs> I don't know. This is fantastic. This is somebody, something everybody <laughs> needs, right? Thank you. How did you, yes, so how did you engineer this? Where are you based? Uh, we are based in San Francisco, uh, but our team is very international. We have uh, three people in Poland. I'm from Poland, too. Uh, one person in, in Ukraine, one person in Canada, one person in India. So everybody's from somewhere else. And we work remotely, but uh, our office now is in San Francisco. And uh, it took us three years, actually. It's not three easy to years. do. Yes. We oh had a God. previous platform before. What which, is it? Um, is it Hitman? No. <laughs> uh, is it Mamando? No. <laughs> no. Is it no. Skyscanner? No, we would be millionaires if that was Skyscanner, but no. It's um, it, it was called Quest Organizer. You probably didn't hear about it. It was it was kind of small, but we still had uh, a lot of users. So it it tested the idea. What like was it, it confirmed the name? that the idea the works. Name was Quest Organizer. Quest Organizer. Yeah. Right. Um, but it wasn't easy on the user. That's why we created Airwander and uh, 
Here are some other cool things you can do with Airwander. For example, this is a flight going from San Francisco. Oh, what's going uh, pretty on there? Much around the world. So you have uh, three destinations and a stopover between each destination. And that actually reduces your price significantly. Oh my god, um, you can go all the way around the world for this price? Yes. Actually, it, it's even better. Like, here's from London. Uh, this one, uh, it's only 975 pounds, yeah. and you go to seven countries across five continents, and you actually cross the Atlantic and the Pacific Ocean, so you literally yeah. go around the world, yeah. and yeah, pretty much you can visit all those places for 975 pounds. <laughs> That's crazy. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight flights. Uh, and you go around the world. It's yeah. not a return, it's around the world. It's around the world. It's a return. You start from London and you return from London. And in between you go to uh, Madrid, uh, Marrakesh, uh, this is Barcelona, Bali. Los Angeles, Bali, Perth in Australia, and Chennai in India. That's amazing. Have you yeah. used your app yet? Yes, Have you yes. I'm using it constantly. No no, I don't have time to go around the world, sadly. I was planning it this January, but it's not going to happen. But, for example, uh, every time I go from Poland to San Francisco, because I always do that, I always have a stopover. Uh, last time I had a stopover in Reykjavik, so I visit, visited Iceland for I five days. Too. It's so cheap, wow air. Oh yeah, yeah, it was cheap. I combined two flights, I saved $700 That's and... 300 pounds or something, this Wow Air. Yes, it is really cheap and Iceland is really beautiful, so I definitely recommend that as a stopover. Um, other cool stopovers are Dubai, for example, and Istanbul. Yeah, so, uh, uh, let's hope Istanbul is going to stay nice. It's a little bit... Hopefully, it gets a little dangerous recently. Now it's really but... cheap. If you want to go cheap, you can go Istanbul. Yes, you can but, go to Istanbul. <laughs> so, uh, something I wonder is, sometimes I check Hipmonk, I check Google Flights, and for some reason, uh, Momondo has cheaper, like, uh, what you call those strange little companies that have uh -huh. cheaper discounts. Yes. Uh, is there, do you include those? Or what, what, how, how low does your price go? So, uh, currently we have partnerships with uh, two OTAs. Um, so, later when you book the flight, we just like send you and you, and you can book the flight with, uh, with them. Because we don't take payments, we're only a yeah. flight search engine. So, we work exactly like Momondo and Skyscanner. And, you do um, take a commission, right? Yes, we receive a commission. Every flight search engine receives the commission. That's how it works. Well, I think our website may be crashed. It could no, be that we have a lot of traffic. Here. Or oh, maybe the internet. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And you book your flight there. But sometimes Momondo has cheaper oh, yeah. travel agents. There are could cheaper travel those? agents. How do we do yes, that? Yes, we definitely want to work on developing more partnerships, even the partnerships directly with the airlines. Uh, with the OTAs, it's good to watch out. If you book the flight with an OTA to check their... Um, ratings and the reviews that they get some are very strange yes you book and then they tell you sorry you have to pay more uh, or you definitely do you, want to avoid that so or do you want to cancel you get the money back in three weeks that's <laughs> some strange like that it happened to me you definitely have to watch out with otas it's better to check the reviews before you before you book the flight so um this is launched this is launched if you go to how recently did you launch airwonder.com when did you launch uh, we officially launched yesterday. Yesterday, so, yes. And you are on a good server like Google Cloud or something? It's not going to crash? It's not going to crash, no. We're it's on good. AWS, it shouldn't crash. AWS, is, <laughs> it should work? Maybe if we have, uh, I don't know, 50,000 users a day, that may crash. Is there any way I can put in my favorite, uh, uh, what's it called, uh, air, airline uh, partnership? Preferences. You know, like I prefer One World, they give nice yes. miles. Yes, we have filters. Has to load again. Nice. Uh, but we have filters, and we enable you to filter by uh, alliance. And uh, how can you really? Uh, is there some kind of uh, trick Here going you can on? Filter. Because sometimes. Uh, Here are the airlines and the airports. You can filter by price. You can filter by layover if you want a shorter or longer layover. You can filter yeah. that. But you, you don't uh, filter by uh, what's called airline groups. What do you call those? Uh, uh, alliances. Alliances. Yes, we do. How you do? Um, one second. Somewhere in there. Uh, yeah. I th maybe in the airlines. Maybe in the airlines. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And uh, yes. And you can you sign up and get the notifications when the yes oh, you really? can. We are actually working on user user accounts, so that will be our next big release. Uh, what, hopefully what in the next few days. 
next few days, that's it. You, your team is really fast. Yes, we, we try to be. <laughs> so what's your job right now? You're the CEO. Uh, you hear the TechCrunch disrupt. Are you looking for, what are you looking for? Uh, we're looking for investment. We're looking for uh, hiring new people for marketing, uh, for development, and for uh, partnerships. We want to definitely develop more partnerships with airlines and uh, OTAs. Um, and users, of course, we want more users. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you need users and have a community inside, like behind like a forum. Mm -hmm. People share good ideas for where to go for cheap. Yes. And maybe like automatically they get a, a message, they get an email when there's like some very good suggestion for them. Some very good them. Uh, deal. That would definitely be a good idea. Um, maybe we would need a person for that too because we don't have time. All right, that's so we would need a blogger. You need one more engineer. <laughs> yeah, or one more travel blogger to write about this and write right. about promotions. Cool. That's yep. awesome. So uh, what do you imagine next year? Are you going to be bigger than Hipmo? We hope. It's possible, we hope right? We will. It is possible, definitely, it has a big potential. There's a lot of people interested in combining flights to find savings or to visit a stopover. It's definitely a value for the traveler. You can visit more places and you can save money on your travels. I spend sometimes days and days to try to find my stopovers. Uh -huh. And you make it in one click. Yes, we make it in one click. This particular trip, the one that goes from London, we is actually... Is that real or when you click sometimes the price might change because you don't have the latest prices? No, so that sure is real. So this is real. Only sometimes you will have to maybe do the search again because sometimes the flight can expire. Uh, like if I pull out, for example, a link that's like a week old, then the flight may expire, so we have to reload it. But no, this is the real, this is the real price. And it's really fast to do, like this trip, it literally took us two minutes. Nice. And uh, there's some other couple of tricks that I heard about where people buy return, but they don't take the last leg. They, they yes. Skip a leg. That's called like. hidden city. And hidden. skip like that. Skip like. Yes. Do you do skip like function? No, we don't. No. We don't have that. You don't function. want to mess with that. Uh, we just focus on something else, but if somebody wants to do that, they can go to Skip Lacton. Okay. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> All right, that's very cool.